Assalamualaikum everyone, welcome back to my channel Dunya Rang Rang Daily. Today I wanna show you how to make a shirt in Photoshop. I have these three motifs right here. You can see this is red pattern and this is border. This is neckline. So I have these three motifs. I have downloaded these motifs from Pinterest. So before starting guys, if you are new on my channel, subscribe to my channel to get the latest updates about designs. I will, if you, I will also teach how to make dupatta sleeves trousers in upcoming videos so stay connected so let's start i have this i'm opening this file from here this new take the size 40 by 42 and resolution is 300 click ok unlock this layer so guys you can uh, from here go into the image and see the image size you can see here it is written 72 resolution this is quite low resolution you, so you have to make this 300 this is textile industry size i have made it 300 now take this move tool and copy this drag this into this file Press Ctrl T to transform and increase its size by pressing Alt and Shift. So guys you can see this. I am dragging this here press Enter. Press Alt and drag this right here to make a copy of it. I am pressing Ctrl Plus to zoom in. I'm, I have pressed Ctrl Plus to zoom out. Press Ctrl E to merge these two layers. Again press Alt to make copy of it. As you can see I am making pattern. Again press Ctrl, again press Alt and make copy. Press Ctrl E to merge these two layers. Guys again press Alt and make another copy of it. Press Ctrl E to merge the layers. Guys I am giving this layer name Patron. Press enter and I'm making its opacity bit down. You can see here from here I can make the opacity down. Like this I'm taking 87. Press on this layer and this is basically background layer. I'm pressing alt and backspace to fill the black color because I have this foreground color black so I have filled black color. Press ctrl E to merge the layer. Guys, you can see I have made this pattern here. You can make uh, make like this pattern. You can take this pattern in any of your shirt, front side or back side, as you wish, according to your taste. So, guys, I'm taking this bottle from here. First, I'm going into the image to see the image size to increase the resolution. I'm taking this 300. Unlock this layer. Guys, with the help of move tool, drag this file into this file. You can see now press Ctrl T to transform. Make the size larger by pressing Shift and Alt. I'm press, placing this here. Press Enter. Guys, you can see I don't have rulers here. So I'm going into the view and clicking on rulers you can see now I have these rulers I'm taking one of the line from here and I'm placing on 35 
I want a copy of it. Press control E to merge these layers. Guys, with the help of matching wand tool, I am removing this orange color from above. See, this is copied. Press delete button, and you can see this is deleted. From here, I am also selecting press delete button. And make this down like this. Guys, now I have this neckline here going to the image and see the image size. I have this resolution 96, I am making it 300. Press OK. Unlock the layer. And with the help of this magic wand tool, I am removing this grey color. Press this button and you will remove this. From here, also click on this and remove this color. Same like this, remove. Click and delete. Click, delete. Click, delete. Guys, first I'm taking this file into this file. You can see here I have this file here. Press Ctrl T to transform and with the help of Shift and Alt, increase its size. I'm taking the ruler from here. So as you can see, I have here this my neckline. I'm increasing its size. From here, if you have any other areas, you can remove gray areas. After this gray area, I'm deleting with the help of magic wand tool. Guys, you can see I have this shirt front side ready. So, if you want this on black color, you can remove this layer from here and you can see it is on black. Guys, you can see this shirt is ready. You can go into the file and press on save as. I'm saving this in PST file. Press save. Press OK. Guys, similarly, you can uh, delete this neckline, this neckline to take the back side of the shirt. Like this, you have same pattern, same border, and this would be the your back side of the shirt. And sleeve size will be the 20 by 22. You can make the size of the sleeves and give them a border on front side. Okay. Guys, you can see. You can take any color here according to your taste. I'm taking here black color. Press Alt Backspace. You can see this is black. I'm taking different colors and you can see how this looks. Press Alt Backspace. See. You can change here also your color to gray. I'm taking this lemon color, press all pens this. See, this is not looking so much elegant. I'm taking this dropper tool and pressing here. You can see here, color is changed. Press all pen. You can see, I'm taking this color, press all pen this. See, the colors are changing. This color. You 
can see guys like this you can make any of your shirt according to your taste I guess this color is light and nice from here I'm taking black color you can see guys here this is front side of the shirt and if you want patterns uh, like previous thing uh, you can add the patterns here so you can delete this neckline and you will have back side of the shirt and if you want to add any motifs here you can add some pinterest by editing those and you can see i'm showing you the image size you can see this is 340 by 42 inches so bye bye this is all for today we'll see you and in another video we'll see you in another video allah hafiz subscribe my channel to get the latest update okay bye bye allah hafiz so guys this is all for today subscribe to my channel to get the latest updates about the designs bye bye allah hafiz